Yeah. How you doing, man? How you doing? What's up, guys? All right, man. Good, good, good. So uh, we talked to you at media day. What's yep. uh, what's changed since then? What's been your uh, thoughts of the team? That uh, maybe anything you've learned about the team since then? Um, I just learned that we got a bunch of guys that like to work hard. Um, this being the fifth camp that I've been a part of, I feel like this is the hardest camp I've been in. And that just goes to show like how hard these kids work and how hard we all work to want to be great, especially this year, you know, like we're trying to put everything into this season and so far fall camp has shown that. So you guys got some, uh, looks like some kids out there. Is this a new new thing bringing out the, the youngsters? Oh yeah. These kids, uh, they just won actually a, a little league baseball tournament or something like that. So uh. it's kind of nice for them to be out here. Uh, they, Cause apparently they said that, you know how like you have like little questionnaires or whatever. Oh, yeah, apparently right. there's like their favorite team was you see like Bruins. Oh, so. okay, that's cool. Cool, good deal. Did you uh, get to uh, talk to them at all? Yeah, they came to us after practice. A little introduce all themselves, what position they play, stuff like that. So that's cool. Yeah, good to know them. So you guys have brought in some new linemen who weren't here in the spring. Mm -hmm. What have been your uh, thoughts of them um, so far? They've all been good, honestly. We've been rotating a lot. Uh, guys getting reps everywhere. You know, just trying to find the right fit, the right five guys to play. So. But everyone has been exceeding expectations so far, I think. And if they're not, everyone's working hard. And that's that's the thing we don't have to question over here. So I'm happy about that. Is what there makes still, for this to be the most difficult, most difficult camp so far? You said this is the most difficult one. I think it's just every, we, we try to improve every year, you know. Last year, we were good, but we still want to be better. So, and there's a reason for that. Maybe it's because the camp wasn't as hard. So every year, we're trying to step up, do things differently to try and get to our ultimate goal, which is winning. I forgot my question. <laughs> uh, just, uh, oh, go ahead. Uh, just as far as, you know, the rotation, you know, the guys behind, you mentioned, you know, finding five guys, but obviously there's going to be a rotation behind those five guys. Yeah. Uh, how, how's the depth of this group looking? I think we got depth in each position. Uh, guys are rotating in and out, so we don't really know who the guys are yet, which is a good thing, you know, because we're still trying to compete, still trying to get each other better, things like that. So. I think we're deep and if someone goes down, we'll have someone else to step up and be ready to go. I just talk a little bit about Garrett. I mean, he started quite a bit. I started every game last yeah. year, much like you did, um, but didn't play a whole lot his freshman year. Just tell us about the development you've seen from him. Oh, Garrett's been great. He's he's honestly looking at like, he's one of the veterans now in the room, you know, as a guy that played a lot last season. And he's been doing great. As, like this is only his third year in college. He's acting like he's been here, just like a fifth year guy like mm -hmm. me. So. His technique is great, all of that. He knows what it takes, or he, he wants to be great at the game, you know? So you can see that in the way he works his craft and the things and the things he does on the field. So I'm really proud of Garrett and how far he came. How is Ben Roy coming along? Ben Roy like is excellent. Backup center, possibly, too? Yeah, backup center, guard, more interior guy, yeah. But Ben Roy is good. He's, a, he's very smart, very, very intelligent football player. So he can honestly play anywhere, center, guard. Like, he'll, he'll be able to step right in, know all the techniques, know the plays, and... He's, doing, he has, he's having a good camp. So he makes up, I mean, he's not exactly huge. So mm -hmm. you think intelligence-wise, it makes up for maybe lack of pure size? I mean, Ben Roy is one of the strongest guys in the weight room. Is he? So, yeah, okay. so he can do both, I'd say. Yeah. <laughs> how, are, how are the uh, offensive linemen doing in the NIL space? You guys seem to be neglected a little bit, maybe just as yeah. a position group. <laughs> Being old linemen, I guess that's kind of uh, expected. There's a laugh over here. <laughs> We're just we're in the trenches and that's all we really care about. It's like it's an ugly game we play and like we don't really care, I guess, for like this limelight and things like that. It's not really important to our game and our development on the field. So yeah, it hasn't really been of too much importance, but it'll definitely be nice to have some love in the NIL. Sure. Do you have any deals? Uh no, I don't. Uh, it's kind of like for me, I've been trying to just focus on the game, you know, like hopefully I can make my money next season, you know, I'm not mm -hmm. during college. So. Seems like uh, a food thing for all y'all would be natural, right? Oh, yeah, of course. Maybe, maybe that's, <laughs> maybe we can get that in the works for sure. Now that you said like that. Like a fat yeah. salad? Fat yeah. salad, oh, yeah, I can, that, can, that can go down. Some Hawaiian barbecue, maybe. <laughs> what it, um, have you found a really good Hawaiian barbecue place out here? Uh, you've been here a while now, yeah, so I would imagine yeah. you've tried a few. Uh, there's actually this place, um, it's kind of in Orange County. It's called Ipono Cafe. It's mm -hmm. kind of like a uh, newer place. That place is pretty good food. I mean, it's like an hour away. But yeah. It's worth it, though? Yeah, it's worth it. Okay. Like Rutz Cafe. You can't go wrong with the Nail barbecue, so. Yeah. First day of pads, what'd you see today? First first hitting, especially like, let's say, from the defense. Yeah. Um, defense is ready. I mean, our front seven, they're, they're no joke. Uh, they give us tough rubs every day. And it's all the same guys as last year. So we're kind of expecting them to, like, be tough on us this year. And, like, just them 
being who they are and like being big interior guys, having Darius as like a smart linebacker, it just helps us get prepared for the season. Darius is trying to hit people out there, isn't he? Oh yeah, Darius. <laughs> he lays the hat. He lays his yeah. head for sure. Yeah. Uh, we're up against the two interior, a uh, lot of the interior defensive mm-hmm. linemen. How's that going today? Yeah. Oh, it's good. Yeah. Uh, Jay, Gary, uh, David, Keanu, like those guys have really been able to push me and like work on things that I would say like I'm not technically like sound on. So things like that, we're just getting each other better. Good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.